welcome to our first active year's most amazing news. Yes, space scientists seeking to understand the enzymatic regions of powerful cosmic rays have detected an extremely rare or ultra high energy particle that they believe traveled to Earth from beyond the Milky Way galaxy. The energy of this subatomic particle invisible to the naked eye is equivalent to dropping a brick on your toe from waist high. According to the authors of new research published Thursday in the journal Science, it rivals the single most energetic cosmic ray ever observed the oh my god particle that was detected in 1991, the study found. Cosmic rays ever change particles that travel through space and rain down on Earth constantly. Low energy cosmic rays can emanate from the sun but extremely high energy ones are exceptional. They are brought to travel to Earth from other galaxies and extragalactic sources. If you hold out your hand one, cosmic ray goes through the palm of your hand every second but those are really low energy things that study co-author John Matthews, a research professor at the University of Utah. When you get out to this really high energy cosmic rays, it's more like one per square kilometer per century. It's never going through your hand. Despite years of research, the exact origin of this high energy particles still are not clear. They are thought to be related to the most energetic phenomena in the universe, such as those involving black holes, gamma rays, most and active galactic nuclei. But the biggest discovered so far appear to originate from holes or empty space where no violent celestial events have taken place. The recently discovered particle nicknamed the Amatar Su particle after the sun goddess in Japanese mythology was spotted by a cosmic ray observatory in Utah's west desert known as the telescope array. The telescope array which started operating in 2008 is made up of 507 ping pong double size surface detectors covering 700 square kilometers. Yeah, it has observed more than 30 ultra high energy cosmic rays but none bigger than the Amtarsu particle which struck the atmosphere above Utah on May 27, 2021, running secondary particles to the ground where they are picked up by the detectors according to the study. You can look at how many particles hit each other detectors and that tells you what the energy of the primary cosmic ray was Matthews ruled. The event triggered 23 of the surface detectors with a calculated energy of about 244x electron volts. Then, oh my god, particles detected more than 30 years ago was 320 extra electron volts. For reference, one extra electron volts equal 1 billion giga electron volts and 1 giga electron volt is a 1 billion electron volts that would make the Amatatsu particles the 244 uh, minimum electron volts by compression. The typical energy of an electron in the polar Aurora is 40,000 electron volts according to NASA. An ultra high energy cosmic rays carries tens of millions of times more energy than human made particles accelerator such as the large Hadron Collider, the most powerful accelerator ever built, explained Glenis for a professor of physics at New York University. What is required is reason of every high magnetic fields like a supersized LLC but natural and the conditions required are really exceptional. So the sources are very rare and the particles are dissipated into the vast universe. So the chances of the one hitting Earth and Tony said for who was not involved at the study via email. The atmosphere largely protects humans from the harmful effects from the particles through cosmic rays sometimes cause computer glitches, the particles and space radiation more broadly pose a greater risk of astronauts with the potential to cause structural damage to DNA and altering many cellular processes according to NASA. The source of this ultra high energy particles baffles scientist Matthews, a co-spokesperson for the telescope array collaboration said that two biggest recorded cosmic rays appear sort of random with their trajectories are tracked black, their appears to be nothing high energy enough to produce such particles. The Amthrasu particles specifically seem to originate from what's known as the local void, an empty area of space bordering the Milky Way of Scalax. 